I'm back. Welcome back to my channel. The struggle is real with Pajami the makeup nurse. Today is First Impressions Friday and Flower Beauty. It is also PETA Day, Nevada Day, Vietnam War Veterans Day, Lemon Chiffon Cake Day, Mom and Pop Business Owners Day, and it's Good Friday. So let's get started. I'm going to start with this Eucerin Face Moisture Boost Serum. I tried the, um, the moisturizer and I forgot all about this. Immerse Hydration. Three, three times hyaluronic acid concentration. So, and I got this from Pinch Me as a free sample. So we'll see. does have like a skincare like a scent but like not like a strong chemical scent but like I guess a makeup scent or something okay now we're gonna use the flower supernova celestial skin elixir for moisturizer now I don't have too many new new products I mean I have a lot of palettes I gotta get through for first impressions but that's about it you can only use one palette at, you know for Friday I'm gonna use this galactic lip jello gloss balm for my lips it's got a I don't really smell anything. It's not really tinted. It feels nice. So far, I like everything. So I've been trialing this Miles with the order that I did um, last week uh, in this scent fresh. I mean, it's been working fine, but today I used the clean one. Um, they almost sound, smell very similar to me, so I don't know, I mean, I think I would like the fresh one that, that has a little bit better, like, sh stronger scent, so I think I like this one better, the fresh scent. Okay, because I'm filming this on a weekend, I'm going to go in with this Tokyo palette, B BH Cosmetics um, palette, because look at all these colors. So, I want to try to be bold, and if it doesn't look as good, well, I'm not going to work. Um, if I can figure out how to get the cover off, this plastic. Okay. I believe I got this palette from Beauty and More with Renee. All right, let's go in with, well, because I don't really do yellows and stuff. Let's go in with um, mm, Decisions. Okay, let's go in with Neon. I might be going into work today because my sister um, she needed help on a, a project so the I'm filming this um, the weekend before this will go up and so she's supposed to be coming down today and so I am supposed to be going in but obviously hopefully I won't see anybody because it's a Saturday so nobody will be in the office but I do gotta go in so and this lighting sucks in here and now that it's sunny and I'm trying to let the sun give light I I can't see the, in the mirror this lighting sucks in here because there's no light in here it's just you know the lamps in the back ground and then the only light on the ceiling is over by the door so this lighting sucks but it is what it is Better than driving now I'm 15 minutes away, right? 
Okay, let's go in with the really bright one, Tokyo Tower. I guess I shouldn't be doing this in case I do go in and see people, but oh well. Actually, I should have done this video tomorrow on Sunday when I'm filming when I am going nowhere. But sitting here, and my sister will be leaving in the morning. So I'm coming for the day because she has to go back to work. Okay, let's go in with Rainbow Bridge. hard time seeing. I might have to shut that window. Okay. I had to shut the curtains. Hopefully it's not too bad for you guys. I like doing bright colors, but I don't get to I try not to do too much of it whenever I am going to work. Okay, now we're going to go in with... Ooh, let's go in with... Even though it's not a, a shimmer shade, let's go with Kabuki. Okay, I really don't know what color this is, but that's okay. And this is the Pinky Bee Beauty Death Gel Eyeliner, though, in Beach. So, we'll see what Beach is. Oh, it's blue. Well, whatever. It's Saturday. I can add another blue, some blue to it. <sighs> this is yellow and orange. I should have looked at this color and went in with a different color story. Oh well, I forgot I even had this. Until just a second. All right, I don't have a new primer, so I'm gonna use this flower in your prime illuminating primer. I do like this primer. <laughs> I hope I don't look too ridiculous with this look for the end. I guess if it looks too ridiculous, I could always just take it off and go without makeup to work. Okay. And then we're going to use, all right, we're gonna use the Flower Serum Foundation Get Real. Because I don't have a new, ah, and it's about gone. So, oh my, it's just squirting. Okay. 
Okay, let's see if this is enough. It's a since it's a serum foundation. It's not as full coverage. But I don't mind it cuz I do still like it. This would be really good for the summer, but it's going to be gone by then. But that's okay. And then I go in with the full coverage flower full, light illusion full coverage concealer. And this is about gone too. Every Friday I'm trying to get more you a little bit more out of it before I call it quits. All right, now I have the Blush Bomb by Flower Beauty and in the shade Benton. And this is so pigmented that every Friday I'm trying to just use the smallest amount. And it's hard to squeeze just a small amount out. I use this every Friday if I don't have anything new. I like to do that, one, because then I can use the products up that I have and because I like to use everything I don't throw anything away until it's empty all right I got this Avon powder from Beauty and More with Renee again and oh it's all over the place I honestly can't remember if I tried it when I did some of the other make Avon stuff so I know I did like a press powder but I don't know about this and it's like all over the place so I'm going to try it again if I did it already You know, my memory's gotten bad. I pretty much remembered, like, everything that I've used, and now I, I just can't remember. You'd think I would have gotten hit by the bus because my husband... He used to have a really good memory, and he was sharp as a tack. And not, since he got hit by the bus, he he can't remember a lot of stuff, and so I have to like always remind him and text him, otherwise he he will forget. And you think that would have been me? Okay, we're gonna use this Flower Beauty Heat Wave Luminous Bronzer and Sun Swept M1. That's all broken, but that's okay. We use broken makeup here. Because it still works. We just got to like, be careful it doesn't get broken more. That's why I've been trying to use this one up first out of my other bronzers from Flower Beauty. Because of that very reason.
you like my headband my um, daughter made that for me she makes these so if you're and she does also the um, hair ties and if you want like a toddler bowl she makes t um, the bowls for her toddler as well and well, other people too all right, we're going to use the Flower Beauty Flower Pots Powder Blush Sweet Pea PB1. I like this color. And blush. See how pretty it is? And it's buildable. Depending on. How much you want all right we're going to try this wander Be beauty wonder glow illuminator um illuminator wanderess and i believe it's a highlight oh yeah look well that's kind of pretty it's kind of looks like a it's the shade after hours it kind of um looks it's kind of hard to see but it's like a champagne -y color which I like it more icy, but I still do like champagne. Still pretty. Wow. And it was like, I don't have to go in as much. That was very pigmented. So, yeah, I like that. All right, let's just make this full of colors. Let's go in with this green um, Imperial Palace shade. Under the blue, all right. Now let's run this in. This just got all the colors today. Right, now we're going to use the flower the lash warrior mascara This is about getting dried up. Okay, I'm gonna put a couple drops of this in. This BioTrue um, multi purpose solution. Just a couple drops. And then mix it up. And that should get it not as dried up. Okay, because this palette does not have any like shimmers and you know I like my shimmers I'm gonna go in with the highlight and wonder beauty and put that right underneath my brow yeah so my sister was supposed to come last night which would have been Friday night and I'm filming Saturday and she's like well I will I had to get up early and go do some stuff before work so I was up at three and then you know it would have been from where she works to here it would have been four hours okay so this is the tent Dr. Lips tint um, red reddish pigment 100% natural um, moisturizing color tint for your lips and glossy bits. 
Okay, so this, oh, oh it might be just a, a bomb. But I put that pink liner on, so might blend in good. No, it's tinting. Even with the pink. I know you can kind of see the tint. It's a slight tint though. It looks darker just because of the liner that I put on. All right, last but not least, the Flower Seal the Deal Hydrating Setting Spray. And I'm trying to use this up because my other Flower Beauty um setting sprays the pumps don't work so I gotta put that in I gotta put that in this bottle all right you guys this is it for first impressions Friday let me know what you think down below this is a very more bold colorful look than I'm really used to but it's very pigmented I think it turned out okay I don't think I'll use this palette much because it is really colorful um, for me. And I like, oh, well, actually, you know what, though? I do like my purples. So I might dip into it again. Um, I just didn't want to go with purple since I wasn't going to work today. I wanted to try something a little, way different, and I did. Um, but the palette itself was nice. It's, other than the purples, it's not really my color story. Um, the highlight was beautiful. It was, it came, it was really pigmented. The uh, powder um, lasted pretty, uh, it, I think it set pretty good. Um, the serum uh, was moisturizing and it had a little bit of a tacky finish like most serums kind of do. So not bad. And um, the gloss, I mean, it doesn't feel sticky, but if you watch you can kind of see it but I don't mind that um, the liner it worked it went on really good but I don't know how often I'm gonna go to blue use blue so um, I'm just not you know that color person all right that is it for first impressions Friday let me know what you think down below and the riddle of the day is what did Michael Jordan sell at the farmer's market. Comment down below and I'll see you next time. Bye!